Hello, and welcome to another Fish News video. Today we are going to figure out how to do the Michigan. After endless tutorials watching and endless grinding on the off season, since my hockey season is now over, yours might not be, but uh, I finally figured it out. Now, I'm only doing this on ice pads, so uh, I'm going to try to do it as simple as possible and make it as easy as for you to follow. Now, thanks for watching. Let's get back. let's get on. Okay, we are back out in the garage, and well, and we're gonna be trying this now. See, the Michigan consists of three things: the clamp down, the which I will show a clip right now of me doing it, the flip, which is when you flip your stick around and then you have it on the top on your blade. Well, it's actually on your heel. You might not have known that. And then putting it in the back of the net. See, the putting it in the back of the net is actually the easy part because it's just balance of the puck on your stick. Well, uh, I will show you an in depth way of how to do it. First things first, we're going to start with the clamp down. Now, how to do it is actually harder than you might think. Actually, no, easier than you might think. Now, a lot of people you the Sveshnikov way of doing it, which is hold down the top and then opening your blade and then the top. I don't exactly know how to do it. I only know how to do it this way. Now see, the part that we're going to be using is this right here. I have a special tape job that kind of uh, helps me out to tell you where it is. Because, and the first thing I do is I clamp down on it. I put my stick on top of it. I'm going to change the camera angle so you can see it. Then, once I clamp down, then it's going to go up like that. Now, very quickly, I'm going to flip my stick, and then you already have the puck on your on your stick. Now, for the first few seconds, you're going to have it down on top of your stick, because it's a lot easier to have it that way. And then you're going to... And then you're going to hit the side of the net, and it's going to fly in. Now... Hitting the side of the net is the easy part. The clamp down is relatively easy to do as long as you get a good tutorial, a good show it, and that is what I'm going to be providing today. Now, like I said, the clamp down, you push down on one side of the puck, then the puck comes up. See that? If I wanted to do the Michigan, I'd do this a lot faster, but the puck starts coming up, right? Then I flip my stick as quick as possible from down like this, then hit that, then turn it up. Now, I'm going to show you my hands. What I do, this is, this is my bottom hand. This is what I do when I have the clamp down. This is the clamp. I'm pushing down on my on the stick and then looking at the stick that it has the puck lifted up and then as soon as I flip I'm gonna flip my hand Wait a second I kind of messed that up now as soon as I have it up in the air I'm gonna flip it I'm gonna put the camera back further just so you can see the full motion I'm standing up I'm low to the ground, almost, my hands are basically kissing the ground. Then I'm going to push down, then quickly flip like this, and now the puck's on my stick. Now for my top hand, the top hand is actually not that bad, 
it's mostly the bottom hand that does everything. I basically just mimic my bottom hand. It's actually in a lever position where this is actually the highest point, and the lowest point is my toe. And then when I turn around, I turn both hands around, like this. So I go from this to this. On the right hand, it will be like this to this. And in unison. Oh, you didn't see both of the hands. There. Now, thanks for watching. This is Brother Sir Sydney. I hope that this helped you. Bye bye.